tubes. We're starting at the best section, Lord of the Rings. And for you guys who were not here Friday, Mark is out of town this week. So we will not be having him today or on Friday. So you guys voted me to fill in, so I will fill in. So if you're disappointed, it's your fault. So we're just gonna show off the store for you guys who are new. If there's anything you wanna look at, just ask questions, let me know. I'll take you across the store, wherever you wanna look at. Uh, if the focus isn't as good, that's because I'm using an iPad. I don't have Mark's fancy phone. So definitely let me know if you have any questions. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Mark likes the numbers. What's up, Grumpy J, Johnny Flounder, Brick Mom, T Valkyrie, Henry, Jerry. What's up, peeps? Glad y'all could tune in. So yeah, let me know what you want to look at, guys. I'm just going to do what you want today. Have fun with it. You guys definitely wanted me to do it today. I, I outvoted Chris and Daniel by quite a lot, even though I voted for Daniel. I was trying to get Daniel to do it because I, I didn't really, uh, not that I didn't want to hang out with you guys, but I didn't want to take the time out of my day. But I'm here now and I'm ready to have fun with you guys. This section was just organized, so it looks nice and fresh. Top shelf. Yeah, T Valkyrie, that is quite reasonable. Top shelf is always a good thing to look at. We shall make our way up there. If there's anything else you guys want to look at, just put it in the comments. Uh, Sully, any Star Wars Hoth build sets? Let me check since I'm over here. <laughs> I'll give you $5 to stay at the lower than case the whole hour. Tempting, Corey. It would not be hard. I could bore you guys real quick with that. Here's a little Hoth cannon. Sully. Let's see what else we got here. There's some snow speeders, it looks like. I'm not seeing too much. There's a Wampa Cave there. So not, not too much for Hoth right now, Sully. But that's what we got. Probe Droid there, if that counts. You wouldn't have to pay him. That's right, Josiah. It would not be tough for me to stay there for an hour. Show, show the things in the store you want to buy. That would be all good stuff. That's fair. I appreciate that. I would say it's the Lord of the Rings case, but I'm pretty sure I have all of that already. This is cool. I like this uh, Brickheads, the Looney Tune one. It's the only two I actually have from the, uh, uh, what is it, Looney Tune series. What are you still missing from Lord of the Rings and the Hobbit? Uh, I have all the minifigures. I'm missing the building, just like the, you know, the tree and the two spiders. I don't have those. I have all the figures, but I'm missing that from that set and the Mines of Moria build. So I am missing those too. I also don't have the black gate, but to be fair, I have a custom one that is better. Um, so I don't really think I'll get that. No problem, Sully. Can we look at the AquaZone sets and minifigures? That is on the way to the top shelf, so we can go do that for you real quick. Is there an NRG, NRGJ in stock? Take a quick break, come around here and look at Ninjago. Try not to make you guys sick. There's all the J's. We actually, Grant just restocked these. So if we had one, he would be out here. It doesn't look like we do right now. What's up, Carb? Welcome back. We are doing good today. It's Joe instead of uh, that weird guy from the Lego Masters. All right, let's see, AquaZone, AquaZone. Minifig should be in here. And if we have any sets, they would also be around this area. So I'll give you a quick little overview here. If there's anything you see that you're interested in, we do have a 20% off all built Lego sets. And as Ed would say, built Lego sets are sold as is. Missing a piece? Forget about it. The black spaceman is in good condition there. He is $100. I think we do sell variants of these spacemen with the different variants of the gold. 
because some of the gold will wear off on the uh, space logo. So we might have it in a cheaper variant. Sealed Blacktron, reasonable price to place, might have snag. Yeah, we do have one right here. These go real quick. Still deciding if I should open a bill of mine or not. But we are selling those for $60, which is a pretty good deal. Wouldn't complain about that too much. Instead of 190 for the gift with purchase. Uh, what's up, Brick Virus? It is not Mark today, it is Joe. Mark is out of town. And you guys voted to get me on here to do the live stream with you guys. What's up, Dawson? Do you guys know when the sale ends yet? Hoping it lines up with Atlanta BrickCon. Um, we'll see. It probably will not go quite that long, but it is hard to say. Sorry for the shaky camera. The iPad is slightly unwieldy. Um, but we, we just started doing the 20% off uh, a couple days ago. So we'll see how long that goes. Braden, what you got? You got a new I shirt? I got a new shirt. Nice. That's the Shroomkin, which is a custom kit that we have for sale. Looking swag. That's what the kids say these days, I think. Uh, any Pharaoh Quest set? Let me look. And T Valkyrie, we'll get to the top shelf soon. Just uh, give me a little time. Okay, Brick Briar. So I, was, I wasn't sure if you knew or not. So, Fair Quest. Don't see anything. There might be parts of sets in there. Sweet T Valkyrie got one of the Black Tron sets. I hope you enjoy that. What's up, Nexus to Zach? Hello there. General Kenobi. I'm getting married in June, Dawson. Thanks for asking. Johnny Flounder had a spare pipe versus a spare bedroom. Ooh, that's not good. No, you'll miss Atlanta BrickCon. That's sad. Poor Grumpy. Sock with camel on your latest haul. Any red barons? No, I would have remembered that. That's a very cool set. Make our way to the top shelf here. It's a little rainy outside, but it feels good, so we're letting the, the cool air come in. So we'll start on the top shelf here. Don't think too much has changed. Got the old Batman set there, Batmobile. The OG Millennium Falcon, Aluminum Falcon, I think is actually what it's called. This old city set here, very cool. Do they have a hospital though? That's the question. Nope. No, why would they need that? They just need a police station, fire station, and looks like an auto shop. Some big old Technic sets there, some super cool ones. Got a Marisk liner, triple E. And then oh, there's- Oh, hey, you're not Mark. Oh, oh dang sorry. it. No. Oh, sorry, Daniel in the wild. Once again, been spotted. Mark is going to be on a cruise ship. That is correct. Is Mark tied up in Vogan's basement again, forced to watch Nexer nights? No, Nexus to Zach. Again? Again, yeah, that's what I'm more. I'm worried about that. What's up, Plump Daddy? Thanks for tuning in. Some more top shelf sets here. Original ATAT. -AT. 2014 ATAT, -AT, I think. Or maybe, no, that's 2007. I believe. One of those two. Dino Attack set. Or is it just Dino? Is that just Dino, Daniel? Huh? Is that Dino or Dino Attack? That is Dino. Okay, just plain Dino. Plain old Dino. Nothing but plain Dino. Nothing but Dino. Oh, T Valkyrie and Johnny Flounder dropping that uh, Danielle emoji. Uh, and the Chris emo emoji. Hazy Dave is dropping the Chris emoji. Ask Vogan about that. He knows what the reference is. Oh, no. <laughs> So, uh, Nexus to Zach asked, is Mark tied up in Vogan's basement again, forced to watch Nexter Nights? Uh-oh, he's running. Oh, he definitely knew what was going on. That's a little sus. Oh, wow. We'll figure what out what that's, what that's all about later. Yes, he is traveling abroad to negotiate with the Nexo people. We got some really cool monorail sets here. And Caitlin. This has the original price tag on it for a whopping $16.99. It's on sale. A toy liquidators. So that's that's wild. That's super cool. Original UCS 
Snow Speeder, TIE Fighter Collection. That's a very unique set. The Rebel Blockade Runner in black and white. Can we get a fit, fit check from Vogan? Got to get that fit check, Vogan. What you got today? What you rocking? All right. We got some Nike Blazers. All right. All right. We got some Wrangler jeans. Cuffed them. Cuffed them. Ooh, ooh, so you can get ooh. a better shot of the sneaker. Swag. Swag. I like it. We got an Oakley, Oakley flannel. Nice. Nice. See, uh, we got a... Pink Floyd t-shirt on. Swag. Always. Swag. And, and what a, we got uh, up here? Astro World dad hat. Nice. Travis Scott. Nice. Yeah. There you go. Very swag. There's your fit check for Vogie. Don't laugh, Daniel. It's what the people it's want. It's a good fit. It is. It's hilarious. Um do, do. Vogan so fit he eats the McDonald's fries. Nah. Vogan sticks with the healthy stuff. Chick-fil-A fries. There's another monorail set, another accessory pack there. No original price tag on that one, unfortunately. We got the new foosball table in, or table football is the technical name for that. So if you're interested in that set, that we got one. Brand new sealed at retail price. Santa Fe and Santa Fe. Ooh, don't tell Corey. I think he already knows, but these are two super cool sealed Santa Fe Super Chief and then the Santa Fe Passenger Card. Super cool, both sealed, I believe. I'm going to New Zealand in March next, this is that. I hope you don't follow me there, that'd be a little weird. But if you want to come visit at the same time, that's fine. Foosball is for the devil, Grumpy J said. All right. <laughs> I think that's a quote from something too. Probably. Corey said, my wallet hurts too much right now. Yeah, it's tough. Those are cool sets. But when they're sealed, they are pricey. This is a, a new one we put up. The Fantasy Castle set. Super cool there. Ghostbusters Firehouse. Not Firehouse. Ecto-1. And then that cool Arc-170. Tri Fighter combo set from Toys R Us. Yeah, Carbo wants both the Santa Fe train cards. Yeah, that's tough. Those are good sets. We got the Queen Anne's Revenge certified pre owned. That's pretty sweet. Then we got the Barcelona Soccer Stadium. Also pretty nice. If you're into soccer. Cafe Corner. Still got that, guys. If you uh, want one to start your modular collection or finish it. We got one sealed, two sealed actually. Got a few of these VIP gift of purchases sets. The Eiffel's, the Eiffel's Tower apartment. Eiffel's apartment. Come on, you didn't you didn't pronounce it wrong when you were a kid. The Eiffel Tower. Okay. That's how I, I I remember at least some of my siblings pronounced it wrong. The SpongeBob is six hundred sealed, Brick Virus. We should ban Star Wars Pirates for Castle and only have Rock Raiders in my own train. No! no. <laughs> they all said no. All right, there you go, Corey. Absolutely. Round off the top shelf here with the Lord of the Rings and the Hobbits and the goat set. And original Diagon Alley. We've got a few Urukai Army sets there. The stud buggy. Got some extra containers here. What else you guys want to see today? Just gonna mosey on over here. But if you guys want to look at anything else, just let me know. We got two Cloud City Boba Fett sitting right there. You say a whole house? Yeah. Yeah. No, that's that's not a house. That's a few months rent. <laughs> So we got some really cool poly bags in here right now. The stud buggy is 550 certified pre-owned Carbo. Super cool set. Sealed Rock Raider? Let me look. Hey, Ethan, how much is that sealed Rock Raider set there? One of the ones I don't have memorized. I think it's 600. This one? Yes. 
$500. $500? Is it yeah. sealed or is it newish? Make that tall boy work. It's newish. Newish. So it's newish. So it's not all the way sealed for $500. Oh, no, no, no. You're welcome, T Valkyrie. What is wrong with the Two Face that makes it a misprint? That is a good question. It's one of the most unique misprints I've seen because it's not necessarily shifted or anything. But if you look at it, his face is supposed to be black printing where his eye and his mouth are on the left side. But it somehow is not. It's the purple or slash pink color from the other side of his face. So it's quite interesting. Oh, the ER. T Valkyrie's gotta go back off to work, saving lives. Johnny Flounder still has the Black Pearl without fix. Very tempted with the cell, hoping the cell would go on when I'm in there to get it in person. That's valid. We do. Sorry, it's very blurry when I zoom in, but we do still have one right there. And I believe it is 350 or 400. And there's a Lego Master in the wild. Hello. Not on a cruise yet. Not yet. When are you leaving? Uh, day after tomorrow or something. There you go. So, they're off. First time out of the country. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Fair enough. All right. Going to get the stud buggy and both giant trucks for model team. Going to be a few months rent. Yeah, absolutely. Better sell a kidney. There you go. Bye. Bye. Braden is leaving us. Bye, Braden. Like Ethan is sad. Whoa. Bye, buddy. Hope you find your dad. No. Sorry. All right, Dawson. No, I have not played that. Sorry, the song is stuck in my head, people. We've been playing the Monsters, Inc. song way too much today. Do you have any of the 501st figures? Droids or Super Battle Droids? Yes, Chunky Kitty. We got plenty of those. I'll show you what we've got on the case, but I know we also have some in the back. So we've got lots of clones here, and we, we have more in stock than you can see here. We haven't restocked it recently. Um, we just got a bunch of good ones like the wolf pack in and such. There's one right there. Um, there's your 501st you're looking for. We also sell some in bulk, but I think we're out of stock on most of them over here right now. So only a few of the jet troopers left there. I will let Steven know that you said to enjoy the cruise. Steven here on a weekday. Exactly next to Zach. He's finished. He's working on commission that we've got. Trying to finish up on that before he heads off. Some cruise ships have Lego stores. Seriously, that's crazy, Carb. Steven and Mark going on the Lego cruise in Heart Lake City. Wonder if they'll meet Marcel. I hope not. There's some unique sets just hanging out in this case here. Big old Star Shore from 2007. That the, no, that is the new one. We have a new ATTE here. Ethan, I didn't realize we had the new ATTE. It's right here in this case. Really? Yeah. Solid. Yeah, I just finished building mine. It's such a good set. So if you don't want the figures, which I mean, the figures are great, but if you want more of the, the set, it is 20% off and that's a very nice set. Uh, if you want individual minifigure prices, Chunky Hitty, the best way to look at that is if you go on our website and just search it there. You'll be able to see all of what we've got, which ones are in stock, and what the prices are. Batman section. This is the best store ever. Thanks, Best Garmando. Yes, we will. How much is the Monkey Kid boat? Let me pause real quick. Monkey Kid boat is 140 140 for the Monkey Kid boat and 20% off. So, Batman section it is. Show you the DC sets real quick before we walk over to the cases. 
got quite a few of the Lego Batman movie, other Batman. It's all DC, so yeah, I'm not too worried about it. And then Marvel is over there. The new Quinjet, we have one of those in stock. That's a fantastic set. If you guys don't have it already, I would highly recommend it. Let's go look at the DC case here for you. There's a tumbler there, which is a fantastic set. Lots of belts, DC, mostly Batman sets, but DC in general. So lots of built ones there. So let you guys just get a look at what's going on here. Ooh, the big Technic one. That's cool. And then lots of DC minifigures. A lot of them being Batman. Shocking. More DC, more DC. Yes, Joker's Low Rider is pretty great, Grumpy. I just I do agree with that. I also really like let's see if we have one. Yeah, there it is. I really like um the penguins right here. Pretty sweet back there. The Arctic Fowler or something. Whatever his car's name. Arctic something. It's pretty sweet. Do you guys accept to use city sets? We'll take anything that is Lego. We'll give you store credit or cash value. Store credit is always more. Definitely your best option. So feel free to bring it in or send us a trading form on our website. Ooh, the Forrester Hideout gift purchase. That is a good set next to Zizak. I love that one. I just built mine recently to go with the uh, Castle in the Forest set and it looks fantastic. There's a few more DC sets there for you. That's an X-Men set. Why is it in there? Someone didn't know what they were doing. Kids these days. All right, what else you guys want to look at? Because somehow we're back at the Lord of the Rings slash Hobbit section. What? Yeah, Corey, that's that's a good point. When people come in and get cash instead of credit, it hurts as much as people at the Lego store not getting their VIP points. It's Yeah, it's just better. Always get more to Lego. It's a better investment than just cash. Classic Castle. All right, Johnny, we will head over there for you. Ooh, spinning around. And if there's anything else you guys want to look at, just let me know. I'll take you over there. Make sure you hit the like button. We're only at 15 likes from what I can see. And if you guys want me to wear the next armor, you have to get to 50 likes because I'm not Mark. I don't play. You guys got to get a lot of likes. But if you want me to be nice to you, you have to get one like, and you guys did, so I'll be nice to you. Oh, 16 likes. Someone liked it. Someone's listening. Here you go, Johnny. Minty Basil the Bat Lord. Nice. We got lots of classic castle, as always. It could have been Andy next to Zag, very true. We'll have to ask for sure. Ooh, Grumpy J got a red coat to add to the collection. Don't tell Malister. Come after you. Idea slash icon slash model team slash creator expert aisle. Yeah, those are kind of spread out a lot, but we do have this model team set here. I think it's the Mach 2, no, Mach 2 Redbird truck or something, transport. I don't remember exactly. Is Malastor or Morgan even here? I know, neither one of them are in the chat today, it seems like. So there's your, there's your set right there, Carbo. Nice model team set, certified pre-owned, and the box is in great condition. To like, oh, great condition. Okay, I can speak sometimes. What else did you want to see? Ideas. We've got some of the idea sets here. Let's see. Yeah, there's the Adidas shoe. Although that might have not been ideas. That might have just been gift purchase. Some of the gift with purchases are ideas. Some aren't. I think the... Eh. Oh, knocked over black trunk. Yeah, there you go. Ideas. That was an idea set. 
pick up the Blacktron. Buy it now. All right. Do you have a Sokka figure in your collection? I absolutely do. I have the Fire Ship and Sokka. I don't have the Air Temple, but I have the rest of it. So Sokka and Momo were the only ones I was missing as far as figures go. So I do have a Sokka, yes. Five five nine one mom team looks fantastic. Wallet is sweaty. Yeah, you gotta pull the trigger. It's only gonna be here so long. Yeah, next is Zach. That is weird. Where's 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 our guys at? Morgan and Malister. Have you seen Top Gun Maverick? It's a top ten movie for me. Yes, Josiah. Those are great movies. Both Top Gun and Top Gun Maverick. Super good. Would be really good for me if you could open a store in Lower Hut, New Zealand. There you go, Beetlejuice. One day, maybe. I am coming to visit New Zealand in uh, a couple months here in March. So I'm super excited about that. Come see the, the Hobbit houses and such. So if you have any uh, ideas of things I could do while I'm there, that'd be great. Still trying to figure out what there is to do. Maybe they are the same person, Grumpy. That's a very good point. Maybe Malister and Morgan are one and the same. Oh, awesome carb. That's good. What's up, Stanley Pratt? Drop the Nexo emoji. We can go look at that because I ain't worried about it like Mark is. These are very cool custom modulars, and they do tend to be very expensive, but they are all 20% off. So if you're interested, that's a great deal for those. Bring some Hobbit figures to take pictures with there. That's a good idea, Johnny. I might have to do that. That would be pretty neat. Do you have a built Quinjet from the airport battle? Um, we might. Let me go look for you. Fellow Joe. Let me spin around here. Oh, look at that. There's one right there. No, that's not the one you're thinking. But you said the one from the airport battle. This is the one from, um, oh wait, it's the one back there. There's the one you're looking for. You're just hiding in the back. So yes, we do have one. I cannot tell what the price is on that one because it's too high up. I only could do it because of the camera. Cost, I'm not sure. Let me try to look for you again. I have to look through the camera. I'm trying to find the sticker. If you call the store and ask, they'll be able to look at it for you. So I would recommend doing that, Joe. What's the price on the sealed Lego Batman movie Batcave? This one here is 200 not a bad price at all for a bat, bat cave, especially the one from the Lego Batman movie. Uh, okay, Chief, if you found $20 plus tax on the floor, what would you personally buy in the store? So if I could buy a $20 set in the store, basically. Hmm. $20 set that I want, that I don't have. I mean, I guess I could get multiples, but... It's a good question. We have one of these new Thai bombers. That's cool. So that's a cool set there. If you're interested in that one, we have one. Um, man, that's a tough question. I would probably buy a minifigure that's 20 bucks, just because that's usually the best option. If, if I had 20 in credit and there wasn't a, a cool set that I was like, yes, I want. Though this is a cool one. I think this is 20 bucks. Yeah, I'd probably get that for 20 bucks. It's a very, very cool set. I love that. It's just super cool. The Looney Tunes figures I actually know and love. Do you have a sealed 2021 Tumblr from the Dark Knight? We have uh, this built one from 2014, but that's the only Tumblr we have right now. I don't think we still have the... Yeah, we sold the one we had in box, but it was still the 2014 one. 
The 2021 one is great. I have that one personally, and it's a good build, so I hope you can find that. Hopefully, we'll get one in for you. All right, what else do you guys want to look at? Do you want to look at Lego Movie, or do you want to look at something else? We do have two sea cows. That's quite glorious. You could have a sea cow armada, and they're 20% off. So don't forget, everything built in the store right now is 20% off which is a very good deal on some of these very cool build sets. Like that. Uh, that's a very unique set. I don't know anything about the game, but it's super cool. And also, ah, uh, Nexonites. Someone did ask about Nexonites. That's right. It's right here behind me. I know Mark would probably not like this, and that's exactly why I'm doing it. So here's some cool Nexonite sets. We actually have some really good ones. Uh, Jester's Lair, I believe this, or Evil Lair probably is what this is called. This is a super good set. And then the Fortrex Classic, obviously. If Nexo can be classic. So lots of sets there for you guys if you're interested. These should all be on the website. Just like most sets in the store. Alright, what happened to the Mark minifigure in the city, Joe? Let me check Nexus. Let me see what's going on there. Good question. I didn't know if anything was different. Thought he was still surrounded by his fans. Let me look. Oh, he is no longer surrounded by his fans. I don't know what is happening to him. Did you have something to do with this Nexus? Why is there a shark chasing Mark? What have you done? On the other side. I feel like Nexus has something to do with this. Got some cool figs here in the city. Oh, that looks like Nexus right there, holding Daniel's shoes. And that might be Daniel? Probably Daniel. No, Mark, don't jump. That's right, don't jump, Mark. It's just a shark, it'll be fine. You just might lose one leg. Um, we'll get back to Star Wars here, but we'll start over here. Got the stud portrait, older slave one. Oh, yeah, and a UCS Millennium Falcon with a stand on it, which is super cool, and you can display it in way less room. So I think that's a custom-made stand there. Works quite well. And there you go. That's pretty sweet. So if you don't have this already and you want one, it's seven fifty. dollars But don't forget, 20% off. Hello from Germany. What's up? Thanks for tuning in. Right to left, Nexus, Daniel, and me. Let me go back over there and look. I don't know if I saw Gary. There you are, Gary. Hiding behind the pole there. There he is. Oh no. Nexus, Daniel, and Gary. Daniel looks a little shocked. Might be running away from you there, Nexus. Wait, if you line it up right, Nexus is getting beamed down by aliens. Are you an alien, Nexus? Oh, Dr. Jaw Jaw, thanks for tuning in. Ethan, are you leaving us? I am. Bye, Ethan. I hate Caitlin. Can we watch the counter real quick? Yeah. Whoa. Hey, do you want to play? I ordered because I got a comment. So we just got a call. Oh. What? Did and someone? The customer bought this for you. What? Yep. They bought that for me? You guys. Thank you, Vogan. That's ridiculous. You did not have to do that. I will I will display this with much pride. Here, Vogan, can you set it up by the counter? Yeah. Who was that? Let me go back and see who did that. Who asked that? Okay, Chief, was that you? You have to tell me now. I need to know. Price on the Darth art. Let me look. AC Day. It is 120, 20% off. It looks like it's missing the border around it. All 
All right, here's Star Wars. Someone asked about Star Wars. Not an alien, he says it all oh, innocent. Yeah, I think you are. Morgan's in the chat. Yay, Morgan decided to tune in. Welcome, Morgan. We see the Lord of the Rings slash Hobbit sets. Always, Dr. Jaja. Ja. You know me. You don't have to ask twice with that. It's like Mark with next tonight's. I actually have a good amount of sets here. And then all the ones up front, too. And also, all these glorious minifigures. Eudemus. Malister's in the chat too. So Morgan and Malister both showed up at the same time. Look at that. Recovering from Florida trip. There you go, Morgan. Yeah, exactly. Next is Zach. They both came at the same time. They were probably on their own private live stream with Mark or something, doing something, something sketchy. I'm just kidding. Ooh, look at that. Another Urukai army set. Our power is linked. There you go. They're too powerful together. We must stop them. All right, let's look at more Star Wars here for you. Can you tell me how you make those minifigure stands? Um, it's mostly styrofoam, actually, that we've just cut and, you know, hardened. it's been hardened by the paint that we use over it. So it's just done like that. You know, we glue it together as we cut it up. And then we use uh, old base plates that are damaged and we cut them up to, for the long strips there. They are the same person. I don't know, Nexus, maybe. It's hard to say. I don't think we'll ever know. What category would you say you guys have the most sets in? Uh, Star Wars. I don't think that's tough. So we have lots of Star Wars, and that's just because they've made it. They've made a lot of Star Wars. All these built sets you see here are 20% off, guys. There you go, Nexus. That's why I'm going to Texas, not Florida for spring break. I don't get spring break. Although I guess New Zealand is my spring break. I'll take a spring break from work. Thanks for the info. Absolutely. <laughs> Florida wipes your soul out. There you go. You cannot stand, stop the power of the band hammer. We are yin and yang. Unstoppable. I believe it. Here's more built sets for you guys. A gunship there. That's the one with uh, the Jedi Bob figure. So if you already have Jedi Bob and you need the gunship to go with him, there it is for you. Any built Star Wars Rebel sets? Good question. Let me look. Well, there's one right there. This is Ezra's speeder bike there. That's a good one. Um, let me see if there's any others. Let's see. Let me go back over here and start from this side. There's an Admiral Yularen from Rebels. It's not a set, but it's a great poly bag if you don't have that one already to go with your Rebels collection. Not built, but there's a sealed TIE Advanced prototype there. I think we also might have a built one. Let me see, let me see. Built A-Wing in there somewhere. Stanley, probably an A-Wing somewhere. I'll keep my eye out for an A-Wing. Here's a case here. This is the last Starfighter I need, but I don't want to get this one because the stickers are a little bit worn on it. I want one in perfect condition because I'm needy. Let's see, nothing in there too much. Just all these helmet busts. A few sets hiding up here. This is a really cool set here, the Bounty Hunter ship. All right, let's go back over here. Sorry if I'm spinning around too much for you guys. Um, thanks, okay, Chief. I appreciate that, man. Thanks so much for that. That was so kind of you. I appreciate it. You did not have to do that. But I will definitely display it with pride. Thanks for tuning in, man. How do you guys decide your prices for buying sets from people? Bricklink, Bricklink is what we base it off of. It's a percentage of that, and it just varies on what it is. All right, there's a Rebel set for you. It's the Ghost. For only $10 and 20% off. That is a steal. What's going on, Will Lamb? Yeah, I did guess your girlfriend's name once. That was quite bizarre. I think it was Jessica, if I, if I remember correctly. I don't remember why I remember that, too. It's another Rebels poly bag there. 
do 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 rebels and anyway that's what i'm looking for um do do darth vader what you doing here darth vader just hanging out Ooh, another starfighter hmm Ooh, this is the other ATTE from 2013, I believe, with Coleman, Trevor, and Mace Windu. Aha! I found an A-Wing. Look at that. There's an A-Wing for you. Anyone watching Bad Batch Season 2? I watched the, the first two episodes when they came out. I didn't even realize they came out. Oh, also another A-Wing. Different version. Um, I forgot to watch the latest one, so I'll have to go back and watch that. Um, there's the Resistance A-Wing down there. And the other A-Wing, the 4 Plus A-Wing there. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. I haven't talked this long in a while. Voice is, like, hating me. Um, doo -doo -doo. I'm waiting until it's all out. Yeah, that, that's one way to do it, Johnny. Just binge watch the entire show. Malister, I recently saw there's a planet in Star Wars named Malastare. Trivia, which character is from there? That sounds familiar, but I don't know. That's a good question. I'm curious now. Do you have the Incredibles minifigures, Joe? Personally, no. But does the store? Maybe. I don't see any more Rebel sets for you. If you saw something and I missed it, great. But I don't see any others right now, Jerry. This is cool, by the way. This is the one from the TIE Fighter collection. This, I don't even know what that's called. A TIE made up set. Because that was the one that they just kind of made up. So let's see if we have Incredibles minifigures. What's up, Melatizer? Hello from the Lakeside Lego store. What's up? Western, please. Yes, we will get to Western. Do you guys have a build, build a minifigure place or pick a brick tape bulk area? Yes, I'll show you those in just a second, actually. All right, let's see. Incredibles would be over here somewhere. <laughs> There they are. So we do have some right now. Mr. Incredible, Mr. Incredible, Dash, the, whatever that was called, and then that dude. Who needs a price tag? Looks like his price tag fell off. <coughs> are those poly bags on the website? Yes, they are, Jerry. Those are great ones. Admiral Yularen is awesome. What a good figure. It's okay, Malister. No worries. Senior Alien Teen, who is a grand. Interesting. Are those the three-eyed aliens? No Doug from the pod racing. Doug. <laughs> wow, Nexus. Yeah, Mark with his plastic leg crystal addiction. He does have a condition. Doug from the pod racing. Who's Doug? Is that a species of one of them? Because I don't remember a Doug. Ah, Sebulba. There you go. Sebulba is the one he was thinking of. Right, there you go. That's where the Dugs are from. Very cool. Wait, that's the one with the... What is it? Zillow Beast? Something like that, I think. Maybe I'm wrong, but... I think that's right. Am I right? Tell me, Morgan. You know. Let's see. Let me catch up here. The answer I was looking for. Uh, I didn't know that was Doug Trump. Does Mandar, MNR, come to the store often? He comes every now and again, but uh, he will be at the Orlando store. We are opening uh, a lot more often. Here's Western for you, uh, Will Lamb. He's going to have a studio at our, our new place, so that's exciting. So you guys can come meet him there. That is correct, Stanley said, about the Zillabies. Okay, cool. That's what I thought. I was I was pretty sure. Ninjago Temple of Air Jitsu. I will show you Ninjago. We do not have a Temple of Air Jitsu right now. I do know that much. Thank you, Stanley. Yeah, I have a lot of random knowledge in my head because of what I do. I remember way too many things about Lego and thus the themes themselves as well. So 
So we've got a lot of good Ninjago in stock right now. Not No Air uh, Jutsu Temple. <laughs> I dismissed Sebulba because he's a frankly an annoying character. That's that's fair, Malister. What is the opening day for the Orlando store? We're not sure yet, but it'll be late spring. What about Watto? <laughs> yeah, where's Watto from? Grumpy wants to know. He will turn you into goo. <laughs> You got new sets. Ooh, Wakanda Forever sets. Very cool. I don't want that whole set, but I do want the M'Baku figure. I, I love that character. Pretty so cool. He's pretty cool. I like the wings on his. Oh, on Namor, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's a cool ears. print that they did, yeah. yeah. So Very they did well with those minifigures. I still think it's weird that they decided to take a boat into the ocean where they were the strongest, but I'm not gonna. I didn't make the movie. I don't know. <laughs> I, I feel like they could have done better but agreed oh well hey they won in the end so they won yeah what about star wars battle packs you have laying around we should have some of those we show off the here's our bulk someone was asking about the bulk table got all this pick brick and these drawers are usually full too and we constantly are dumping new brick on here after we've cleaned it and stuff and then we've got dumped the two new bags this morning let's see caitlin dumped two bags this morning there's a Build-A-Fig there, just a bunch of random Lego parts, usually pretty basic stuff. You might find some good stuff in there every now and again, but they're also really cheap, so that's why. Let's see. Toydera, there you go, Malister knew it. Malister said, Wado is Toydarian from Toydera. Brother Steve, what's up? Here's our city with lots of your minifigures in there. From you guys who are members, you get to put your minifigure in the city. So if you haven't already, contact us about that. Let us know who your, uh, or what your sig fig looks like. We've got some really, this one right here is one of my favorite just because of how bizarre it is. Hidden side, Ninjago, Hagrid, it's, uh, it's quite the mix. Got Morgan's chilling over here. Looking all swag with his lightsaber and camera. And Mark is jumping off the building. Don't jump, Mark. <laughs> Malister said he was a funny character. Zwolba had nothing of value to the story. Water was a baddie that fell apart and had a story that was actually relatable. There you go. What's up, brother Steve? Thanks for uh, tuning in. I would come every day, yes. Yeah, it's uh, when you work here, you see everything every day and it's hard not to buy. A lot of stuff. But then there's rent. So. Video. Everyone's favorite Lego theme. Video. For you guys who don't already have some. Buy it. So we don't have it anymore. Just kidding. Video has some really good minifigures. It was just an odd theme the way they tried to do it. Same with inside with the, the whole phone thing. But they did make some really good minifigure parts. I remember Steven was asking me. This one. Here it is. He was like, oh man, I want this figure. Because he wanted this shark dude. Which is just awesome. And this squid guy, which is sick. So that's ridiculously cool. But because it was made in a hidden side set, it's not as cool. Because you don't want the full set, you just want those figs. Quato is the best sick fig. Let's go look, Plump Daddy. I do love him. He is quite a beautiful figure. He reminded me of an overweight fly. That's fair, Grumpy. Mark Sigfig reappeared, indeed. Let's see, where is uh, Aqua, Aqua Auto? There he is. Bye, see you Lego guys, Master. I won't be here for the Joy Building, but I uh, will be true. back after that. The Joy Building will be me and someone else. We'll figure that out, but- You guys should vote on it, you should have a vote on it. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, Aqua, glorious. Aqua Auto. Glorious, there's also Darth um, Auto. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's hilarious. I didn't see him there. I believe that's... No, it's just the chrome saber. Yeah. That's so funny. That's awesome. Yeah. All right, Steven, have fun on your cruise. Take care, guys. Take care, man. Bye-bye. We'll see him Bye. next week on the Joy Building. But this week, we'll have someone else on the Joy Building. I wonder why. I'll never tell. All right, Nexus, be mysterious. Did we, have the bomber out here? we did have a tie bomber. Let me show you where it's at. Let's show Vogan that sick tie bomber. Oh, look, he found did it. Have the I told you. I told you. Look at that. Did you raid the city? He better not have. 
You better watch out, Nexus. I will protect my city. Cool lighting. Yeah, the lighting is super cool. Kids love it. Adults love it. I love it. So we've got this button here. So when people come in, they can just go. Then it lights up. And we've even got some motion in here. So this is rotating and going up and down here. Got lights there on our Christmas tree that we never take out. And if you see gaps, that's because we're redoing our city and uh, going to be sprucing it up and adding some new buildings. And then we've got our Christmas train because we haven't fixed it. Uh, and then we've got our Marvel scene over here. The Sanctum Sanctorum. Or Sanctorum. Some skyscrapers. Epic Avengers scene. Galactus just chilling. And got the dusting up here and the ant-man going into the quantum realm we got stuck for like five years so that's that's my contribution to this i built this van and i'm very proud of my little van um but i didn't have time to help with any of the rest of it but it did turn out fantastic got the avengers tower there top there's a little fragile but the stark wording is pretty cool there Joy building with Grant Vogan. That would be cool. I don't know if that's their schedule will allow for it. They're both in school and Grant's got basketball, so he's busy. Um, so we'll see about that. But that would be a good joy building. Cool and looks awesome. Thanks, guys. We appreciate it. Will it be Billy Ray Cyrus? Let me just call my boy Chris Proud up and see if he can, you know, cancel his plans and come and do it with me. <laughs> I haven't been to the store in over two months. I wouldn't dream of raiding Lego City. All right, Nexus, just be suspicious. We haven't looked at Harry Potter yet today. Let me look at that for you guys. We've got about eight minutes left here. So lots of good Harry Potter sets. The chess set is one I have. I love that one. We've got some of the new ones. We've got the Courtyard Serious Rescue. Ministry of Magic. I love the colors and parts on that, especially the green masonry slash profile slash whatever you call them, brick bricks. I like the Ant-Man scene. Thank you, Josiah. It's pretty neat. Can you rebuild modulars? Yes, I will. Grant riding the bench again. That's right, Nexus. He warms it up for everybody. All right, Malister. Take care. Thanks for tuning in for a little bit with us. Heading home from the office. Have a good one. Especially Grumpy. He can be as grumpy as his custom. There you go. Here's a very good built modular. Here's a custom built modular. Which is pretty cool. Casino. But also... The Brick Bank. That's a very good built module. I didn't realize we still had this. It's kind of hidden. So that's 600 but it's 20% off. So it's a good deal. You're saving 120 bucks on that. All right. Let's look at the rest of the built modulars. I'm sure we've got more. Do, do, do. Try not to trip here. There we go. There's a Parisian restaurant up there. Elvis. Uh. Spinning, spinning, spinning. Sorry for the spinning. See you on the Nexus. There you go. There's another custom modular done by Mort Eriksson. That weird Lego master guy. Got this Barcelona stadium up here as well. Are you selling Big Queen Amidala? Yes. For the right price. It'd be very expensive and we do like it. So you'd have to pay a lot for it. Assembly Square there. It's a cool one. It's a very good one. I think that one's about to retire or something. All right, let's see other. We've got parts of Diagon Alley laying around. Built modulars, built modulars. Okay. Me over here real quick sorry to spin you guys around show us some respect for the king of rock oh sorry <laughs> i was like what are you talking about the elvis uh oh the bookshop that's a good one and another assembly square in the corner there um, just for curiosity, how much for the Nexo door arch? No, Grumpy, I'm sorry. 
unless you want to pay like a thousand or two thousand or five hundred thousand overcharge you i don't i don't know that's pretty cool i think we want to keep that especially for mark's sake he's really attached to it all right let's look at the rest of the built modulars more Diagon Alley. We actually don't have a ton of built modulars. This isn't quite a modular, but it's close. What's that? Who's that? I see something. Ooh, uh, <gasps> oh, uh, hey, it's Mark, guys. Welcome back to the live stream. I love crystals and Nixonites. Ooh, I'm addicted to crystal. Ooh. But the Lego kind, obviously. Uh, I think that's all the built modulars we have right now. This is not a modular, but also a very cool built set. One I'm, I'm tempted to get, but might wait on that one a little bit. It's got also the green leaves back there as well, so you can have the fall or spring. This is $200 and 20% off, which is a really good price. So if you're interested in that one, go ahead and come get that. I'll have to call the bank accounts, accountants and the bank. There you go. Who would survive a zombie apocalypse? I know Mark would not because he survived it faster. Yeah, Mark wouldn't last. Although he, he has good survival skills, so he might. He might feed Steven to them. Price on the one Mark built. Let me go look. Joe sells the treehouse to buy the treehouse. There you go, Jer Gary. Yeah, the reason I traded in that sealed um, treehouse is I hadn't built it yet. And I, I wanted to. I just hadn't had the space yet. And then the castle came in. I didn't have anything else really to trade, so I sacrificed the castle. That is four fifty for you, and it would be twenty percent off. But that is four fifty AZ day. Daniel will probably do the joy building. We'll see. He might. All would be fun, but we shall see. Yet to be determined. All right, we got about three minutes left. What do you guys want to see as we wrap up here? There's a Lego Masters trophy, but that's not even cool. It's just kind of mid. Just a trophy. But there's this. That's a cool set, the carousel. That one's 350, 20% off. Need cool new custom figs. Actually, Bogan's been working on the custom figs, right? Yes. Updating. So we should have some good stuff. We have some of these. And we have some of these. Ninjago little spinner thingies. Ninjago spinner thingies. Woo! <laughs> we love Ninjago spinner thingies. Does the trophy count as 20% off built set? Yes, 20% off $2 million. Um, ask Daniel if he's doing the joy of building. Uh, I don't know. We haven't decided yet, so I can't ask him because he doesn't know. So the Marvel is a little bare right now because it hasn't been restocked, but if you look at Star Wars... Star Wars custom fix. He's working on the labels right now. He just finished all of Star Wars yesterday. Yeah, Star Wars is all full and looking great. So all of these should be online or are getting there. So we've got lots of custom Star Wars figs. Some really good ones that I'm surprised they haven't made. Jedi Temple Guards are some of the best customs. Because they just haven't made them. There should be a sensor that causes angelic music to play and a light shine down on the trophy every time you approach it. That would be good for Zoom. That would be awesome. All right, now we just got that one little light break, but we'll do what we can. A light shining down from space? Oh, don't get for Zoom too excited. You said space. I think if we pull our money and store points, maybe we can buy the trophy. Uh-huh. Yeah, you try that. We'll see if Mark will let you do that. Ooh, since we're on built sets, here's the... UCS original Falcon. So we have the old and the new Falcon, both available for 20% off. This one is 1200. So 20% off that. And then you can also get the new, oh, sorry. The new UCS Falcon for 20% off. So if you're a big Star Wars fan, you should get it. If you don't always have it because you're a big Star Wars fan. Got a bunch of poly bags here. These should all almost be on the website. Space, smoke and lasers. Sharks with laser beams shooting out of their eyes. Sharks, machine guns. No, lasers, sharks, laser sharks. It's a good movie, I need to rewatch that one. Lego should make a royal starship. That would be cool. <laughs> Joe calling out the obvious that the trophy is $100,000. Yes, it's very, very valuable. I'll sell it to you for a couple million, you know. 
Mark will never have to know. Space Sharks. Space Shark Tornado. All right, on that note, we have hit 60 minutes. Thank you guys for tuning in. I appreciate the support. Thanks for hitting the like button for Mark's sake. Uh, we'll see you guys Friday. I'll put out another poll today. You guys can vote on who you want to do the Friday live stream, just like you did for this one. And yeah, we'll, we'll see you then. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you at the Joy Building as well with me and someone, if I'm even on there, who will know? All right, thanks for tuning in, guys. Bye.